Pandas are one of the most beloved animals in the world. They became synonymous with certain corporate entities and are commonly used to market cheap Chinese takeouts. But now, they're on the brink of extinction. Their birth rate has plummeted to dangerously low levels and every day they seem less and less concerned with the survival of their own species. Animal experts and scientists have done all they could to entice the pandas to mate, but they haven't been able to produce any sustainable results. Instead of engaging in depressing and often disappointing coitus, pandas seem just content to sit around and practice celibacy as their population continues to dwindle. Many are concerned about the future of these animals, but a feasible solution seems to be just out of our reach. But can we really blame the pandas? Let's be honest. What exactly do they have to live for? All their lives, they've been raised inside cages or crass approximation of their natural habitats and paraded around for entertainment. The high point of their days usually consists of being pelted in the face with catacorn by incorrigible children. And sometimes they're utilized for some motion capture work for forgettable feature-length films. Now, does that sound like a life worth living? I think it's safe to say that the pandas have made a conscious decision to end their own existence. They deemed it far too cruel to bring another life into this world and I'm in agreement. Imagine raising children in a house where you're constantly being monitored by handlers while tourists keep taking pictures of you, gnawing on bamboo sticks or pooping on the cellar door to voice your displeasure at your own mistreatment. Imagine being shown pornography constantly to entice you into having sex when you're suffering from crippling depression. Imagine being told to bear children when you still have hopes and dreams, things you still want to accomplish in life. Imagine being told that you have to raise that child when you're not even ready for parenthood. All of these things individually are enough to break our spirits, yet this is what's expected of the pandas. So is it any wonder that they have no desire to copulate when breeding only prolongs their waking nightmare? Their bodies, their choice. Let them all perish in peace. It's the humane thing to do. I'm being John Malkovich and this has been another episode of Animal Facts. Stay tuned for more factual animal facts. Have a wonderful animal day.